This video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer. The one and only a father in a minivan. Wow! Okay, I had to make this video because I'm getting very sick and tired of apes saying I'm jealous of Lou. Lou versus Wall Street. Okay, here's the situation. I am not jealous of Lou. Let me let me let me make everybody understand something right now. Okay. When I make videos, the Ape Father doesn't care about subscriptions. I don't care about views. I just care about being myself. That's it. I tell it like it is. You can see I don't care about subscriptions. Do you want to know why? Because all I do is lose subscriptions, right? So, see, everyone's trying to make a case that I'm jealous because Lou's got almost 80,000 subscriptions and I got a little under 11,000. I don't care about subscriptions. I don't care about views, okay? Here's my problem with Lou. You want to hear what it is? Okay. I feel Lou, bottom line, is not an ape. And there's just too much evidence that I have that I know I'm right. Okay. Here's the first evidence. He never showed his portfolio. Never one time. One, not one single time did Lou ever prove that he owns any AMC. Now, according to the fact that Lou, um, even though you, you guys love him, but these are facts, that he got arrested he robbed $73,000 from senior citizens. The judge ordered him to pay the restitution back of the full $73,000. Lou told the judge he cannot afford interest. He said, I can't afford interest on the restitution. So basically what he was telling the judge is he has no assets. He has no money. He can't afford interest on the restitution. His mother had to put up $50,000 in bail to get him out of jail. He has a court order to live with his mother. Okay. And... He cannot leave the state of New York. So this whole concept that he's going to go to, to Las Vegas and party with you is a bunch of bullshit. So according to the fact that he told the judge he has no assets and cannot pay back the, uh, the, the interest, can't pay the interest on a restitution, it is a physical impossibility that he has stocks in his name. Because if he would have stocks in his name, the judge would order it to go towards the restitution. So unless he's doing something illegal, <laughs> which he's putting stocks in someone else's name, which I don't think he's doing because that constitutes further fraud. And I don't think Lou wants to go back to jail. It's in my opinion, Lou does not own AMC. Now you might say, so why is that such a big deal? I'm down a hundred thousand dollars. I put, I put my life savings in AMC. You know, I get treated like shit by a lot of you apes. I really do, and I, I hate a lot of you. You want me to tell you the truth? I'm gonna like come come clean. I would say I I love fifty percent of the ape family, and the other fifty percent of you, I think you're idiots. I think you're all retards. Okay, I think you have no respect because I've done so much for this ape community and you all treat me like shit. You call me the scam father. You 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 insult me all the time on everything. Everything. You tell me I, I had to sell 500 shares because I had to help my, my family. You're calling me a sellout. You're calling me a piece of garbage. But you know what? You could all go fuck yourselves. Seriously. You could all go fuck yourselves. I fucking hate you. Seriously. I don't like you. <laughs> I don't like none of you, okay? Now, the other 50% of the apes that actually treat me good, that appreciate my entertainment, that appreciate the good I do for the family, I love you, okay? You're my true brothers. You're my true sisters of this of, of, our, ape, of our ape movement. And you know that the ape father is all heart. You know I'm all heart for my family, and I'm all heart for the true apes, the true AMC apes. Now, another thing I don't like about Lou is this. is like the guy keeps acting like he's got all these secret connections. You call these these effing stupid apes called be the con father. He's the con father, Lou. Okay, what connections does he have? Oh, I, I, I got secret connections of the most prestigious Wall Street traders. Yeah, all right. L look at me. The guy is the biggest bullshit artist, con artist that has ever lived. He's taking no risk. He's always at the doctor's office. God only knows. <laughs> okay. He's always calm. You ever notice that how relaxed he is? You ever notice how calm he is? It's because he's not risking anything. Okay. You're all gullible. That's another thing I hate about all you people. You're all gullible. You're all gullible. You fall for it. You fall for every bullshit. You, 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 you know, all I'm trying to do is good things. Okay. You criticize me and you fall for all kinds of bullshit out there. Like all you idiots that give Macor's money. Okay. That enrich this, this weasel. You enrich him with his super chats. <laughs> you know what I mean? Listen to me. I don't really care anymore. You want to know what? I'm just going to say it flat out. 
flat out. I wish all of you Lou people would just go go with Lou and go disappear somewhere because you're the dumbest, stupidest people on earth. You believe in a criminal who robs from senior citizens. Now, every day, what does he say every day? He says, calm down, calm down, relax, relax. Yeah. No, you want to win, you got to take action. You got to take action. That's how you win. Okay, you don't win by doing nothing. You don't win by sitting sitting down with your thumb in your ass. Okay, because Ken Griffin, believe me, that's what he wants. He wants you to do nothing. He wants you to sit back and let him manipulate this to fucking zero. That's what he wants. Okay, and you're giving him what he wants. You know, if you guys all had balls, you all would be marching with me, protesting with me, fighting with me. Okay, but you know who you're fighting with? You're fighting against me. I'm the one trying to get AMC to have the Moaz. I want us to get awareness. I want the news to cover us. I want the world to hear about us. I want the whole country talking about the apes. But all of you stupid apes are listening to a criminal who who's who, he's risking no money, no money at all. He's always happy. <laughs> he's always he's not risking anything. He's making fifteen thousand a month on YouTube. Yes, his channel is monetized. Lou vs. Wall Street channel is monetized. Makes $15,000 a month. I, I don't even think he's paying back the poor senior citizens he stole from. God only knows where that money's going. It's probably in like his like mother's name, his YouTube account. <laughs> the guy's a degenerate. I'm sorry. That's it. Okay, and you want to know what? He's going to keep... See, Lou doesn't want the Boaz. Can I tell you what the truth is? Lou, people like Matt Kors, people like Lou, people like Trey, they don't want the Moaz because they're making a fortune. This is what you don't understand, all of you idiots. They're making a fortune. Lou is making $15,000 a month. Matt Kors is probably making 500000 in Super Chats, plus with his ad campaigns and all of his merchandise, he's probably making a million dollars. Trey made over a million dollars. You think they want this to actually happen? They want the Moaz? No way, because then all of this ends for them. All of it ends, okay? So that's my problem with Lou. And you know what? I really don't give a shit anymore. Like I said, I wish that all of you Lou fans would ever watch me. Just go watch Lou. Go watch Lou. And and this concept that he's not going to ask you for money, you wait and see. You wait and see, motherfuckers. <laughs> okay, because Lou's got something up his sleeve bigger than fucking Niagara Falls, bigger than the Grand Canyon. All right, he's got something up his sleeves. And this concept that I ask apes for money, Listen to me, you fucking buffoons. I have not made one single dollar. Let me repeat this. One single dollar from this ape movement. From any ape. I gave money. <laughs> you understand? I donated money out of my own pocket to help out ape brothers and sisters. I have made nothing. No money. You guys keep saying this. Oh, you keep asking apes for money. Motherfuckers, I haven't made any money. Okay, if anything, you should be thanking me. You should be saying, hey, father, God bless you. Have you, you helped people that were starving? Eight hey, brothers and sisters, you helped them when they were sleeping in a car. You got them a hotel room. Okay, you helped someone whose house burned down. His mother passed away. His wife had a baby on the way. You helped them. Instead, what do you do? You criticize me. You insult me. You make up stories about me. So, you know, this is what I say. All of the haters, all of the fucking Lou fans, go fuck yourselves. All of you. Fuck you. <laughs> okay? Or let's let's use Lou's famous terms. Go fuck your mother. Okay? And as far as all the real apes who know that the ape father is all heart, he knows he's all, all soul, all for his ape family. <laughs> all right? I love you, baby. That's a kiss from me to you. I love all of you. AMC to Pluto.